Espresso. Welcome to English. My name is Mrs Glover and I'm the curriculum leader for English. We would like to share our department with you today. Throughout lessons, students will be able to study a range of themes and skills, including literacy, reading, writing and oracy. Our classes are organised by skill to ensure our students make progress with any area of their need. We'd like you to take a little look around and enjoy. Welcome to English. What is learning like in English? In English you can expect a starter when you walk into the class, fun during the lesson and lots of class debates and discussions. What do you enjoy about English? In English I enjoy group discussions and class debates. In English I enjoy creative writing because it's kind of like my way of uh, giving other people a glimpse into my imagination. I like creative writing because it's fun, relaxing and interesting. What I like about English is my teacher because she makes every lesson fun. What I like about English is how, how much you can learn and how much you can learn. Who are the staff in English? Hello, I'm Miss Martinez. You'll find me in the English Department of Chelsea School. I'm a key stage three leader for English and whole school something for everyone in our Year 7 scheme, we will explore the different aspects of oral reading and writing through a range of different themes. I also strongly believe that the promotion of reading for political pleasure is significantly important. Therefore, I can't wait for you to join us on your reading journey. Hello, I'm Mrs Benjamin and I teach English here at Chepstow School. And one of my favourite books that I want to share with you today is a book called Wonder. And this is something that we teach here at Chepstow School and it's my favourite book at the moment for lots of reasons. One day is a story about a boy called Augie Pullman, actually August Pullman. And Augie has a condition called Treacher Collins Syndrome, which means that he was born with a condition that makes him look and sound different to everybody else that he knows. Now, the story follows Oggy and his journey through school and how he's treated and how people treat him unkindly actually throughout his time at school. The moral of the story is that you should always treat people with kindness. You never know what's going on in someone's life. I urge you to read it. And perhaps if you come to Chepstow, then you'll read it here with me. Hello, so Miss Broccoli, I teach in EN2. And this is my reading wall. There are a hundred books up here that I would like you to read by the time you leave secondary school. Reading is huge to me. I absolutely adore books. One of my favourite books is Ink Heart. My and uses this. silver tongue, which means that when she reads, the characters from the books come alive and come into the real world. And I really like that idea. You could read like Treasure Island and Pirates could come out. You could read Black Beauty and a horse could come out. Whatever you want could come out of the book just by reading it. That's something magical and something special to me. I'm really looking forward to teaching you all English, and so hopefully see you soon. Bye. Hello, my name is Mr. Robson, and I'm a maths teacher, but also head of Key Stage 4. And it was very important to me to make sure that literacy and numeracy is delivered across the curriculum and the range of subjects. And I've been working very hard with the English department, and the English department have come up with this fantastic resource, Meet the Person Responsible For. And you can see here there's keywords, reading actions, appearance, writing, reputation. And the idea is students will look in the mirror and they take responsible for all of these words here. So they own the literacy, the numeracy, the keywords going forward. I really look forward to welcoming you to our school so you can enjoy the fabulous resources that we've got on our campus. Thank you. We hope you enjoyed watching our video. Thank you to all our staff and students. We hope to see you soon.